Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jingxu. Let's talk about problem 5 in chapter 3. In this one, we still do the calculation of vectors. You can see we have a vector and we know its magnitude and its angle theta. We need to find the two components Vx and Vy. Then, after we find the Vx and Vy, we need to do it reversely and use Vx and Vy to find the magnitude of the V and angle theta. Let's see how we can do it. First one, um, we can see because we know the magnitude for V and angle theta, so we can split these vectors in, in two components. Okay? Yes, and this is the theta. So we can see in this triangle, this side is theta, so this side must be v times cosine theta there. And because it's pointing to negative direction, so we add the negative side there. And then we can see the y component. So in this triangle, this side is v, so it's a sine theta, right? sine theta there. And then after that, after we know Vx and Vy, we can do the calculation to find the V. It's 24.8, yes, and the angle theta. Yeah. Thank you.